The energy vibration um, reading for the year 2019 for you Virgos you hurt sign people okay you Virgos I love you so much please remember to like share these videos and remember that this year is a year of water a lot of things is going to be happening to you guys a lot of changes is going to be coming up in your life um, it is a year of the feminine energies and it is also a year of you connecting with yourself to find out what is going on but also to change your whole energy vibration okay so you Virgos had a good beginning to the year you have earth energies um, but you have to deal with um, positive energies that is going to be coming in um, please like and share this video this video is going to be over an hour long um, 30 minutes will be on YouTube but the rest you have to pick up on the on demand and um, because this video is so long it's uh, really um, and this is your year reading so um, this uh, um, video has a lot of information that can help you throughout the year okay so um, for you guys um, you are going to be um, realizing and seeing who are your enemies um, that energy fall out for you Virgos so some of you are going to be um, finding out who are your enemies who are working against you um, this is going to be coming out okay so be aware of that so um, the quarter reading for the month of January to March is already out so you can pick that up um, it's already out because it went out before the year readings for you guys to be aware but the energy that fell out is that some of you Virgos are going to be realizing who are your enemies you're going to be have to be dealing with these people in this year it is a year where love um, connected with your twin flame and soulmate some of you are going to be moving money is going to be coming in um, the Knight of Wands uh, you could be dealing with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius this person could be a child or it could be a friend or a family member okay so be aware of that we're going to be looking at the rest of the nine months in the year for the Virgo Sun Moon and Rising sign so we're calling in on the spirit guides of the and the star seed of the Virgo Sun Moon Horizon sign. You guys are very powerful, very psychic. The energy of the moon comes up in July. So in July, um, you're going to be um, finding out something about people around you. This is coming out in the month of July. Okay. I princess comes back. So some information is going to come out in October. Wow. You Virgos are hitting it in this year and why is that is that you have the energy of the fountain which is the center so some really surprising things is going to be coming out some of you Virgos could be connecting with the 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 star seed um, if you are a star seed you could be connecting with your family um, that is going to be coming out in this year but some luck is coming out for you Virgos okay you have the energy of the fountain energy that comes with a fountain is the energy of some of you are going to be very very much um, um, being successful um, and there is the energy of the Aries also coming back some of you are going to be successful in work that is going to be coming out in November and December energy of the Sun is here in December so it is really not a bad year that is going to be happening for you guys there is just going to be changes um, you guys your energy is here in the month of April um, which is going to be good um, in the month of April 
um, it's going to be good you guys are going to be having a new start in June July you have the energy of the moon this moon is about showing you who are your enemies judgment is going to be coming out um, then we have justice coming up um, then we go to uh, the I princess in October November you have uh, um, I princess in October November you have some achievements some um, new office coming in and you end the year with the energy of the Sun which is so beautiful now for you guys 117 is going to be a very very positive energy now 117 um, is 9 okay because um, 11 plus 7 um, 1 plus 1 is 2 2 plus 7 is 9 so you have the energy vibration of the hermit in this year um, the energy vibration of the hermit in this year now um, with the energy vibration of the hermit which is um, so very weird um, that you're having in this year it's a, it's about light is going to be shed on certain aspect of your life okay um light is going to be a shed on certain aspect of your life this is uh, don't worry i'm looking for the energy of the hermit um that you guys it's about information you could be bringing out the information or this information that is happening it's light is going to be shedding on you okay so I'm seeing a lot of judgment called people who have legal case um, that situation of people who have legal case um, you're going to be winning um, this energy is here for the people who are having legal case you are really going to be winning this these legal case that is happening I have lost the energy um, of the hermit so this is just so um, weird um, and um, and I've seen it because I've used it he has been coming up shedding light on a lot of stuff and in work success a lot of success is going to be coming up in work for you guys um, um, April is going to be a wonderful energy this is this is really so strange um, the energy of the hermit I found you I found you so um, you guys have the energy of the hermit um, 11 and 7 um, 11 is the energy um, of strength in this energy vibration it's the energy of strength that is here in the month of May seven is the energy of you moving forward and being victorious over a situation so you looked for inner strength in this year the hermit is coming so a lot of you are going to be connecting with your star seed family they are going to be coming in and they're going to be helping you some people call them the et but it's the star seed family that is going to be coming in and helping you and you um are going to be very psychic okay you're going to be learning to balance out the material world and the physical world and this is good so let's move in and look at the energies that is going to be transpiring for you Virgos. so um your year is not looking bad it's a tested year is a year where a lot of tests are going to be happening in your life so a lot of stuff is going to be happening in your life so there's a lot of testing that is going to be happening in your life okay so again um this reading is going to be taken um an hour long and um if you want to see the old extended reading um please connect with us on on demand on demand is 101 99 um so um you will receive a lot of lot more information that is going to be happening okay so let's go ahead and there's going to be some heartbreaks in relationship there's going to be some heartbreaks in relationships so um, you need to be aware of this and I'm so sorry guys I hate to do this but I got to go get my telephone because I'm expecting uh, someone to come and do something
go away. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? I'm sorry guys um, I have someone coming to do some work so I just realized that I had a missed call from the person hello hey I'm doing good um what time are you gonna be coming okay okay so when it when is it gonna be I, I just didn't have my phone on me Um, it is um two thirty. Okay. Okay. All right. I'll do that. All right. I'll do that. I think the chin sent it. Oh my god, I'm so sorry guys. I'm gonna cut this they love the video out, but I just don't want to and I'm waiting for someone to do some work in my house. Okay, so um all right, so let's see what is going on. Let's see what is going on. Alrighty, okay, so we have gotten that done. So we're going to be moving forward. Alrighty. So let's see what is happening. Remember that the quarter readings are all out. So um you had a beautiful um um beginning of the year, you Virgos. So you have the energy of the wheel of fortune. This is good. Um the quarter region is already out, but there is also um other messages that is going to be coming out because some time because this is general reading some of the message affect you some of the message doesn't affect you take what affects you and take and leave what doesn't affect you so the wheel of fortune is here for you Gemini's and this is going to be good this is going to be very very positive in the beginning of year that's a fire sign that is also luck as we look at February February is also wonderful it's also good what is happening in February is that you will be dealing with an organization this is an earth sign so you have fire and hurt you're starting the year very good on a very very positive note um what is good is that uh, what we're seeing especially in the month of January with the wheel of fortune it's as if luck is going to be coming to you it's going to be positive information and positive breakthroughs that is going to be coming in in January now in February with this organization um the eye princess listen to your own intuition about these people situations and that sort of a thing listen to your own intuition okay now in March you have the energy of the wheel of fortune and the lovers okay this is positive because it's as if someone your twin flame is coming back you have you was or broken by your twin flame and he or she is returning in the month of March so this is going to be very positive so the first quarter you have fire earth and water fire hurt and water this is good because what does this happen is that in March there is some emotional things so February listen to your own intuition about your situations with group of people organization institutes and listen to your own intuition even if they're saying something else to you in January um, good news is going to be coming in that is going to bring you some luck now let's look at April till June this is the first half year we have your own energy vibration in April and this is good because in April you are going to find in a strength number eight energy and you have your own energy vibration of temperance now temperance is wonderful because what temperance does 
temperance is where you are balancing out certain aspects of your life relationships and you're trying to bring balance in your world and this is going to be good in the month of May you have number um, 11 energy um, it's a portal is going to be opening up in May and you're going to be finding strength to understand that there is more um, the veils of illusion is going to be lifted um, in the month of April for you the veils of illusion is going to be lifted in the month of April for you and this is going to be good as we look at uh, um, June you are going to be dealing with uh, um, a new start so most of you Virgos whether it's in work whether it's in a relationship whatever is transpiring for you Virgos you have the support of your own energy vibration and go and listen to the general readings and this is very important for you to go and listen to the general readings because there are more information in the general readings that is going to be coming up so um, June is a positive month for you Virgos because you're going to be having this wonderful new start in June so accept this new start is the air energy so in the third the second quarter we have hurt fire and hair hurt fire and hair this is really balancing you guys okay this is really where you're balancing certain aspects in your life we're gonna move and look at the third portal okay um it is a positive year whatever is transpiring in this year it's really positive you're having balancing of the same energies we have uh, um in the first half year re you know looking back at the first half year um where you have the fire sign as uh, um the wheel of fortune and then you have uh, the energy of uh, um, strength which is the number 11 energy so some of you could be seeing spirit guides and all of these things that you're going to be looking for in a guidance because the hermit is the energy vibration of your year that is the energy vibration of your year is the hermit the, the nine the number nine is a completion of something in your life and bring it forward some of you are going to um, be receiving message seeing the energy of uh, um, um, your your enemies but also of the people that you are supposed to be connecting with in this lifetime and this is good um, the hurt energy is with an organization um, groups of people that you have to work out a situation with and this is going to be good so you could be a um, meeting um, some of you could be meeting a lover um, in an organization or institute or on the work floor that sort of a thing your soulmate you could be connecting with people on your work floor as um, a connection now the air energy of this new start is good because it's not affecting anything it has to do with love that is coming in for you guys and this is going to be good now as we move to the second half of the year we have the energy of water water and 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 um, justice okay water 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 so um, if you're having a legal situation judgment breakthroughs yes you are going to be winning this legal situation whatever the legal situation is in this year you Virgos have the chance to win it some of you depends on if it's um, a divorce that that you're not going to be winning that because the art break is here okay so you ladies um, that are divorcing you are not going to be coming out on top there is some heartbreaks that is going to be coming here and it's later for five years and older so let's go in and look at the energy that we have in July coming up for you guys the energy in July is the energy uh, the general energy in July is the energy of the Sun now is success is as positive energy is moving forward you're going to be feeling good but July is going to be showing you who are your enemies okay month of July is going to be showing you who are your enemies now this is good because what this is um, doing for you and go back and listen to the general reading what this is doing for you it is basically aligning you to know who is it that have your back and who is it that doesn't have your back and this is how things work because sometimes you think the people who have your back are the people who are working against you so that's another energy 
as we move to the month of August is a new start the energy the general energy is a new start and you're going to be having information coming at you about a new start now this could be people who are divorcing you could be receiving that the divorce is over in August and that sort of a thing you're about to take a new start in your relationship or whatever legal issue that you have there is some information that is going to be coming out to find out if it's positive or negative you can connect with us with um, the on demand which is just a dollar ninety nine you can connect with us with on demand and this is going to be helping you to know what is this information that is coming out in the month of August September a wonderful month a positive month September is where the wishes and dreams are going to be coming true about a legal suit um, and this is going to be good because the Sun is here it's going to be successful so you're going to be coming out on top okay so this is good positive positive energy that is coming in for you Virgos now as we look at October October is the energy of the tower okay October something ends abruptly in your life accept this ending because it needs to okay whatever this ending is and however it's coming in in October is a cleansing for you and your um, spirit guides and the eye princess is coming up in your spirit guides because she is the um, bringer and the veil of your spirit guides is saying okay this needs to end okay because we gave you something in the beginning of the year this what you're doing needs to end because we're bringing in the energy of the tower does no longer serve you let it go okay and that is what is going to be coming up for you guys in the month of October as we move to November a very 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 positive month for you guys especially when it comes to work and business a lot of promotions a lot of um, office that is going to be coming in you're going to be moving you're going to be the leader the, a lot of achievements are going to be coming in um, your star family is going to be helping you to bring this out and this is going to be good November has the energy the general energy of the ego but you have the general energy and the ego has to do with materialistic things being a manager being on the top moving up the ladder that is the energy of the um, the ego but this is going to be good because you're going to be doing it in a positive way so congratulations your best month you guys your best month is going to be um, November it's November wonderful things is going to be happening for you guys in November now December is the energy of um, December is the energy of the moon in the general energies and you guys have the energy of the Sun so in December some of you are going to be finding out and the light is going to be shedding on who are working against you and you're going to be bringing back that rain in. you're going to be standing up so um, there are two positive cards and a negative energy so some of you are going to be realizing that the same people you're in relationship with the same people who you love is the same people that has been working against you and this is what you're going to be seeing I'm seeing a lot of endings with soulmate and twin flame relationship but um, you're going to be successful coming out of this and it's going to be for your best interest okay um, it's going to be for your best interest so no need to worry about that sometimes things just need to end up um, end in your life so that new positive things can happen so let's recap the the last six months of the year as we look um, again we have in the third quarter um, July and August water and water energy so um, you're going to be seeing your enemies you're going to be aware of where your enemies information are going to be coming out but justice is going to prevail because justice is going to be standing um, in okay so you could be divorcing um, your husband and you're going to be realizing or divorcing your wife vice versa and you're going to be realizing oh my god who, who was I married to 
who was the person I was married to it could be a work situation or it could be a friend situation it could be something with the neighbors and you're gonna be thinking oh my god I thought these people were nice but they're not really nice and this is what you're going to be seeing in the third quarter in the fourth and last quarter we have the energy of water fire and fire and this is good because you had in the third quarter you had water water and here and now in the fourth quarter you have water fire fire now the fire fire is is success that is coming in so a lot of people if you have a business get a business reading for this year um, I do um, business reading three months out um, get a business reading because you're going to be knowing and especially people who are managed managers of off dealing and if even you're at work you work someplace get a, a reading um, for your work because then you will know what is coming and you will know how um, to help yourself to move yourself forward um, and to move against whatever is transparent and whatever is happening at your work so um, this is really good this is really positive um, your star month is going to be January January um, uh, January and um, November January and November December okay January November and December 2019 is going to be your star months ladies and gentlemen it is a feminine year it is a year of the feminine energy you can see these feminine energies coming in some of you as I look at the energy the wheel of fortune is bringing you success in a legal suit okay the wheel of fortune is bringing you success in a legal suit some of you there is going to be judgment for an organization because some of you the light is shedding a light on the organization so something could have happened to you and you stand your grounds and now people are realizing what has been transpiring in the organization so you and this is the year of where these sort of things is going to come out and I you know I don't think you did it out of uh, per um, it's just that something deceptive has happened to you and you had to um, you know stand your ground and then by doing that they're seeing the deception that has happened in the organization energy of the lover is here and this is again it is coming up but the energy of the lover is coming up again what is transpiring is that some of you who were married and getting divorced you're you're gonna be thinking oh my god was I really in relationship with that person I can't believe it because divorce is when you really see um, someone for who, who they truly are and you're gonna be very very surprised okay other energies um, for a lot of you Virgos listen to your own intuition okay you Virgos are very intuitive um, people so listen to your own intuition in this year because your intuition is going to be on um, peak eye it's as if it's going to be screaming out now some of you are going to be having a very um, wonderful new successful beginning some of you are going to be having a very wonderful new successful beginning um, there was whatever your enemies and whoever were your enemies they're going to be coming out in December and you are going to be having a very successful beginning for the people who are about to have a new beginning in um, June it's gonna be a very successful beginning okay wonderful let's see um, we're using the spirit um, guides so, so let's see what is happening for you guys in the first half the Buffalo comes up so this is the earth um, energy the spirit of the Buffalo comes up for you guys this is good it has been the Buffalo I think it's gonna be the year of the Buffalo because a lot of um, people have done most of um, the readings and a lot of people got the Buffalo in the first period so it's as if you're going to be taking on the energy of the Buffalo just be very quiet stand your own ground stay out of the heart the way the arms are way of arms of other people this is the energy especially when you have to deal with um, huge organization okay so just be calm be calm um, and be calm because 
um, the meeker you are is the more you're going to be received so be calm the meeker you are is the more you're going to be received so the first six months is more of you taking on the energy of the buffalo being very quiet be hold your own space and uh, moving and that is going to be helping you to move you forward as we look forward what we're seeing happening here um, we're going to be seeing what is the spirit the animal spirit guide that is going to be coming out for the Virgos in the second half of the year you have the energy of the hands um, you have the energy of the hands the fire ends. so um, call upon the universal angels um, the energy of the fire ants is here and I'm feeling another energy is behind so there is a message and the voucher okay the voucher and the fire ants choose one of these energies and work with these energies and because there's three energies that comes out I am going to be looking to find out because uh, um, um, there's a lot of um, animal spirit protection that is coming out so we had the buffalo the buffalo is definitely a hurt energy vibration and the buffalo is just taking it easy it's just standing back watching as things goes by and taking things easy and not rushing it you're just the energy of the buffalo is grounded yet hurtly practical yet spiritual okay trust your um, pure present just trust your home present um, in the first half if you are out of balance reckless lack of gratitude then you need to um, put gratitude in your world priors is going to be one of the most significant things that is going to be happening another hurt energy is the energy of the hands and I'm sorry guys I have to be I have not gone to read this book I'm so sorry but there are so many things I'm working in um, so many different ways and um, I have to um, I haven't read this book I haven't gone through this book and read this book so I'm so sorry that's the reason why I am connecting with this book um, but the ants and that's kind of weird because the ants has to do with the fire energy okay the ants has to do with the fire energy so you